This is Mike. Mike is a 52-year-old financial advisor who is in great shape for his age. He works out three times a week to maintain good health. About a year ago, Mike began experiencing soreness and stiffness in his shoulder. A few weeks later, he developed a limp, and as time progressed, he experienced muscle twitching in his arm. First, he attributed all these symptoms to old age, but they began getting worse, so he visited a doctor and was diagnosed with amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, more commonly known as ALS or Lou Gehrig's disease. ALS is a motor neuron disease that is defined by the degradation of upper and lower motor neurons in the brain and spinal cord, which progresses to paralysis. It begins with muscle weakness and stiffness and then spreads to other muscles, including the diaphragm. The motor neurons cannot send signals to them. As a result, the muscles weaken and begin to die. ALS is categorized in two forms, sporadic cases and familial cases. Sporadic cases account for 90 to 95% of all cases and familial cases are the remaining 5 to 10%. More than 200,000 people around the world are living with ALS, with an estimated 3,000 in Canada. There are one to two new cases per 100,000 of ALS annually, with men two times more likely to develop the disease than women. Death most often from respiratory failure is witnessed within two to five years of diagnosis. Each day in Canada, two to three people die of ALS. Currently, there is no cure available for ALS, but there are drugs that are going through the clinical trial process. Please visit www.als.ca and check out the other videos in the Demystifying Medicine video series on ALS for further information on this disease and how you can help.